interview, we will be talking with Al Song, otherwise known as the wife of Al Song. Can you tell us about your five husbands? Well, my first three husbands would have to be my consider my good ones. Um, funny that now that I recall it, I might have been a little too cruel to them. I remember one time I told when I was cheating on him, or he was cheating on me rather, and I knew it wasn't true, but he was so upset about it, he still gave me what I wanted. My fourth husband and my fifth husband were probably my bad husbands. Um, my fourth kept a mistress, so I'd always try to make him jealous. Well, my fifth husband, well, let's just say he was interesting. Tell us your, your fifth husband. My fifth husband, his name was Jacqueline. He was 20 years younger than me. Um, even though he was, I was able to keep up with his appetite. Um, I met him during my fourth husband's funeral, actually. We, even though I wasn't that sad at the funeral, but Jacqueline made it all better. Um, Jacqueline always gave what he got. And I remember one fight where he was always reading this book about wicked women, and I just couldn't stand it. So one day, I tore three pages out of the book, and I burnt it, and then I slapped him. He punched me, made me deaf in one ear, very sad. Um, and then I punched him back, and then finally we had to create some what truth. What do you between. have to say to the people who think you are immortal due to your multiple marriages? My philosophy is to be fruitful and multiply. Um, and I think it's very hypocritical for the um, Catholic church to say it's wrong for me to have multiple husbands when Abraham, Solomon, and Jacob all had multiple wives at the same time, mind you, while I had mine at one after the other. Okay. Name one of the ways you got your husband to submit to you. One of the ways was my most powerful weapon was I would not give them pleasure until they gave me what I wanted, which was most of the time. What do you think women desire? Women desire for their men to submit to them. Um, it's very endearing, I guess you can say. Um, with my fifth husband, our truce was he would give me all his money and I would be very loving towards him. And it worked out pretty well. Out of all my husbands, my fifth one is the only one I can claim to love. Would you consider yourself a gold digger? Of course, why else marry a man? Why else marry a man other than for money? Did you marry any husbands um, other than my husband? Other than my fifth, no. My fifth is the only one I love. In your tale, oh. you stated that a beautiful woman would be unfaithful while an old woman would be good. Which would do you, which would most apply to you? Um, it would depend on the man. Um, my first three husbands were, I have to say, I was beautiful and very unfaithful. Wow, my fifth, especially my fifth, but also maybe my fourth, I was old and very good. I didn't cheat on any of them. What is your worst flaw? My worst flaw is lying. I usually lie to my first three husbands, and uh, when I'm telling a story, I can never keep the truth straight. Do you have any advice for young couples? I will tell young couples that for men, make sure you submit to your wife. It will just lead you to a happy marriage. While women, make sure your husband obeys you. Okay. Well, this is an interview of Alice Song, otherwise known as the wife of Thank you.